Well, what? Is it done? It's done. Though all did not go according to plan. As expected. More on that later. First a stiff drink and a toast. The North. We're Siggy. Tamaria. Tamaria. Bloody Tamaria. You guys are all gung ho Tamaria. You sure it's not a bit early here? Not to be sure the downer. This isn't premature. Radovid's dead, but it's a long way from that to a free Tamaria. War's not over, not even close. You're mistaken. Tomorrow at noon, the commander of Army Group Center will sign a truce in Amir's name. A truce whose wording we agreed with Dijkstra. So back there in Velen, when the trolls nabbed you? Yes. I was returning from the last round of talks. Amir will keep Eddie and Dirty. Lyria, but in exchange for Radovid's head and a stop to guerrilla activities, he will withdraw from Tamaria. Which will become the Empire's vassal state. Self-ruled internally, with its own courts, administrative structures and army. The silver lilies will bloom neath the rays of the great sun. So I say were I a poet. But I'm not, so all Sounds I'll like say is there was no other <laughs> fucking way. Okay, so... What's... I don't know what built is. Haven't told me the whole truth. You're right on that account. We know you're bloody allergic to politics. <laughs> Decided to emphasize majors and what Maybe. If it were done when tis done, then twere well it were done quickly. That but this blow might be the be-all and end-all here. What's that? Vakmeth, Act 1, Scene 7. Always wanted to play that. Never cast as anything but a halberdier. Geralt, what Tala told you, put it out of your mind. There will be no truce with Nilfgaard. Redania, under my enlightened rule, will fight on until it wins. And when it does, it will unite all the North, including Temeria. What? Ow! This is not what we plow and agreed. Yeah, obviously. True. Instead, we insisted on one realm's questionable sovereignty. And to recover it, we gave Amir virtually all the North's other kingdoms. It was not a wise arrangement, so no deal. You two-faced horse. I will not allow this. I knew one of them Actually, would backstab. You, Roach, should be the first to understand. I've no choice. Why the hell would I understand? Because you too are a patriot, Geralt. This doesn't concern you. You may go. Fare thee well on your path, or what not. No, no. Can't let you kill them, Dijkstra. Oh, hard luck. This then is what it's come down to. Them. Kill them all. Really? Come on, everybody. Come on. Come on, guys. Oh, we're gonna have to take him down. Come on. Deekstra, I can't believe it. I mean, I can. I thought everything was gonna work out. Bloody hell. Bugger me sideways. So now who that rules? Was close. Very close. It's hardly over. The envoy, due to meet the Nilf Guardians tomorrow. No doubt Dijkstra ordered him killed. We'll need to protect him. Sorry, you're on your own, I've You've had your fill of politics, <laughs> I understand. To say the least. Once it's over, 
Come to Vizima. You'll be received with honors. Farewell, Wolf. Wow. Steekstra, are you kidding me? Where did he die? Over here? He had chicken? That's it? Oops. Like, that is, uh, wow. That's pretty crazy, actually. Does it- I wish we could sort these. There's just too many to go through. Actually, maybe the suggested level will... ...be the easiest way to find it. Reason of state. Though Geralt had always prized his neutrality, he did not intend to sit idly and watch Dijkstra thugs butcher his friends. So the Redanian spy's long-awaited moment of triumph transformed into his final defeat at the Witcher's hands. I honestly did not see that coming. At all. Um, at all. Not even a little bit. Okay, so we've got final preparations and meeting Yennefer at the bridge into Oxenfurt, which is exactly what we're gonna do. Leave the scene of the crime here. That is absolutely nuts. Okay. That full moon, I didn't notice it before, but that was triggered with our Tawny Owl. Actually, you know what? Let's take a second here. Uh, let's go until daytime. This was the quest, I believe, where we had to talk to... Yeah, see? Final preps. Help Siri take care of her business in Novigrad. So we have to talk to Yennefer now. Are these sequential like this? Because this is going to go talk to Yennefer. So I'm almost wondering, maybe we go and help Siri take care of her business in Novigrad first. Long live Radovid. Yeah, I think this is the right idea. This is the one where we had to talk to Zoltan as well. Uh, well not this one, I guess. More for um, for Yennefer, because we we're going to get him to like get people drunk or something, but. Didn't he say, like, I'm not gonna... Like, it's not something I'm gonna do, pretty much? Guys, GTFO. Thank you. I don't know, but we definitely need to figure out what Siri's trying to take care of here. We had the opportunity to do so. Uh, previously, but... I want to take care of a few other things. His Majesty, what's this? There she is. Very subtle. Looking for something in particular? Um, a pretty little trinket. Want to give someone a present? One of the people I told you about. A gesture of gratitude. Can we go? I mean, yeah, sure. Lead the way. We need to go to Temple Isle. Don't remember you being religious? Nor am I now. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Almost there. Where are we going exactly? To see Horson Jr. <laughs> but... What do you... What? A bit late for that. He's dead. I asked Sultan, and he said Horson's alive and well on Temple Isle. I was what? there. Stuck a sword in his gut. Your hand must have slipped, because it seems he's recovered. Okay. Why are you doing this again? I want to look him in the eyes. What then? I don't know. Depends what I see. Staring at the eyes What is that? Ow! Simpleton! There's always a surprise when Siri's involved.
What? Here to see Mr. Wiley. Mr. Wiley's expecting important guests, so bugger off. You... you... You what? Chance! Good one. Make a deal, maybe? Uh... Yeah. Yeah. A deal. Go on upstairs. Boss is waiting. After you. That was strange. To say the least. I wonder what they're doing. We'll know soon enough. I don't know how this is going to be explained. Well, well. Who do we have here? Like there is no Finally found your little ward. Took your sweet Way. fucking time. Seems oh, it's do health to me. <laughs> ah, Isn't that uh you killed me that time? Surprise the fucking prize. What? Shut your trap, witch. Or somebody fills that owl for you. Enough. I'll finish what you started. Whoa, whoa, stop. It's me, Doodoo. -doo. Yeah, Doo -doo okay, Doo -doo. okay. You really didn't recognize me. He's got the scar. Doo -doo? Wait, Siri. After the heist, after Dijkstra's vault was emptied, you vanished. How'd I find you? Quick. Butcher's yard, the mama's play, Priscilla's, you dragged me onto the stage. Sheathe your sword, Siri. It's doo doo. God, you give me quite the scare. Well, what are you doing? What Not a dummy. Wise to play games with a witcher. Horse and Junior? Was there no one else you could impersonate? <laughs> right? Once we'd fled, I'd no idea what to do. I could only hide for so long. They'd find me sooner or later. It wasn't our decision. We knew he was dead, but not many others had caught on. That was my chance. No one mourned for Horson Jr. In all his miserable life, he'd never helped a soul. Amusingly, once dead, he became a useful member of society. They say everyone deserves a second chance. Seems true enough. Even if it's not the same someone? Is, in a way, sharing it with a doubler. Doo -doo. Oh, little dudes. That was courageous, Doodoo. -doo. I'd never expect it from you. Neither would I. Oh, by the way, you've no idea at the relief I feel you're alive and well. And I'm relieved I didn't slit your throat. Chose an interesting line of business. Doodoo's always had a head for numbers. What's a few brothels and casinos? He'll manage. That's the thing. I don't need to. Two weeks after Wiley died, I announced I'd seen the light of the eternal fire. Sold all the illegal enterprises. I'm a blue water trader now. Horson's men didn't protest? I've contacts in the guilds. Run a thriving trade. Profits are twice what they were before. To Wiley's men, a purse twice as heavy means twice as much respect for the men handing it to them. Be careful. You could get found out. Wiley's men are too stupid to catch on. His colleagues ain't much better. Mind you, even you were fooled. And that might have ended very badly for you. True. I get a bit carried away at times, but mostly I'm careful. You mean you would think he'd be like, give us a little wink or something. Time's up. Right. It's been real. We must still go by the Golden Sturgeon. It was nice to see you both. And take care of yourselves. You too. So long, Dudu. Why are we going to the Sturgeon? To see a girl who helped me once. Who might that okay. be? A friend of Dandelion's. Her name's B. She's a waitress at the Golden Sturgeon. Helped me contact Dandelion. I wish to thank her. She risked a lot. Risked a lot? How's that? The temple guard were breathing down my neck. If she'd been seen with me, she might have been flogged or worse. Always getting into trouble. I take after you. Maybe later. I always get fresh fish. What's this? Fresh fish. You call this fresh? What is
I visited a city once that was very much like Novigrad, but the people there were much taller and had dark skin. This somewhere in Zeracania? No, in another world. Of course. What's it like, hopping between worlds? Anything like passing through a portal? Or different? Hmm, a bit different. It was hard going at first. I wasn't very good at controlling it, so I had to concentrate intensely. And hope I didn't land in the crater of an active volcano. <laughs> I mean, yeah, the that's true. I did with Avalok was very helpful. Now I merely think of the place I wish to travel to, close my eyes, and it's done. Ah! Geralt? Those were the days. And hungry. Oh, give us a kiss. Gave you we chance. made it. Should have taken it. I spit on anything you give me. You'll regret that, you cow. Mind your manners, you're talking to a lady. Stay out of this. This is not your concern. It just became my concern. Sure it is. You're a fucking freak too. He is. That's how it's gonna be. Very dangerous at that. The butcher of White Orchard. What'd he do there? Trim the trees? Yugen. He slew half the village. Dragged the bodies of the alderman and his wife behind his horse to Novigrad. Let's get out of here. That's pretty good advice your friend's offering. S sorry <sighs> Thank you. I seem more determined this time. You shouldn't cross them, I told you. I'm to bar non-humans from this establishment because some thugs threaten me. Not likely. It's so good to see you, B. And you, Siri. Who's your charming companion? Um, I guess just introduce myself. Geralt of Rivia. Oh, she's heard it. That Geralt? From Dandy. <laughs> Very nice to meet you. I've heard so much. Really? What, for example? <laughs> for example, humor me. How you've saved her from woes so many times she's lost count, and how you always know how to make her laugh. That Siri, of course. Other ladies, however. B, I'm standing right here. <laughs> all right, all right. So, what brings you here, darlings? I wanted to thank you for everything. Oh, stop! Anyone would have done the same in my shoes. Not many would have done it with such courage. Thank you. This is for you. A trinket to remember me by. Oh my, it's beautiful. Thank you. So, will you stay for stew? And keep slaughtered a piglet this morning? Yum. Thanks. But we must still visit Far Corners. I mean, ah, no, we're busy. Off to see Valdo, eh? Well, shan't stop you then. They'll feed you properly there too, no doubt. Farewell to you both, and do take care of our witcher. I Try will. my best. So long. That was cool. Oh, she's not done. Okay. So, your friend, B. What about her? Nothing. Seems nice. <laughs> Geralt, you're terrible. What'd I say? What's there to see in far corners? The camp of some traveling circus performers. Non-humans. When I came here before, I wanted to contact Triss. Life was hard. I quickly spent nearly everything the Baron gave me. Triss and I never met, because the Temple Guard showed up. I was a wanted woman afterwards. Triss didn't try to contact you? How could she? She didn't know anything. In fact, she thought she was to meet another alchemist wanting to flee Novigrad. I preferred not to put her in danger. I was being hunted. Had not a copy to my name. Then I met Valdi. He and his troop helped me, then introduced me to B. And through B, I found Dandelion. You know the rest. Geralt? 
true pest that was Perhaps that can be true. Know what they say about you, Lot. If you seek justice, I love you. Here's Valdo. Where's this friend of yours? Yeah, hmm. I suppose I must. There! Valdo! I beat me a pass. Siri, you devil incarnate, where have you been? Come here, darling. Hello. What's this? Got your granddad? Agar, <laughs> you're incorrigible. Allow me to introduce Geralt of Rivia. Ah, greetings. We've heard heaps about you. Mostly lies, I bet. Ah, if it's a lie that since her youngest years you've been her friend and mentor, then indeed. She is a bold-faced liar. Well, good you're here. Come in the nick of time. We'd have been gone by tomorrow. You're leaving? Let us start resettling non-humans shortly. We'd rather stay ahead of events. I understand. Problem is, we just lost two horses, and another two are too weak to haul anything. Ah, we'll manage somehow. We don't leave till tomorrow, so not to worry about today. Yes, for some. I'm off to see a merchant. There's a chance I can trade our nags for a healthy horse. Wouldn't want Valdo to have anything to worry about tomorrow. What's wrong with him? Is there anything we can do? Hmm. Any way we can help? It's like the least we could do. Oh, don't fret about us. We always get by somehow. Right, Siri? No, let us help. What brings you here? I've come to apologize. I disappeared so suddenly, then... Ah, oh, pish posh. What matters is you're back, and you're well. This is for you. All that you loan me, plus a small premium. Siri... You know I can't take this. And you know I shan't let you refuse. I know. We'll make it the pot for a wager. Oh, God. <laughs> Do you still race? Of course. Then I challenge you. Geralt, will you join us? Naturally. Gladly. A man after my own spirit. <laughs> Come. Geralt, choose one of these. Coming, coming. Okay, I guess we're choosing this one. Move it. Let's go. You were faster once! Giving you a head start. Oh, well, we're a little bit all over the place. Watch where you're going or you'll fall. Can still beat you. I let you win. Yeah, An yeah. Ugly race. Well, this calls for a celebration. Stay the evening. We've several barrels of Kedwin's best. Bonfires to be lit soon round which all will gather. This night shall be ours. Glad we stayed. Me too. They like you here. I like them too. Oh, I'd love to join them. Drink and race, travel from town to town, not worry a whit about anything. Something worrying you now? Probably a lot of things. What awaits us? Defeating the hunt won't be easy, but with the Lodge's support, Avalax, we can do this. I fear fighting the hunt will only be the beginning. For me, at least. Don't worry about that yet. One thing at a time. You do know you can always count on me. Whatever happens. I do. Thank you, Geralt. <laughs> you promised! 
in jest. Sometimes I wish I could be like them. Just carefree. <laughs> Drunk? Yeah, I'll throw it out there. Drunk or giggling. Whichever it is, today's your chance. <laughs> Not what I meant. I'd like to be ordinary. Your life is yours exclusively. You choose who you are. Geralt, you know that's never been true. All because of this damned elder blood. My gift. My curse. You granted me all of these powers, but it's also why I've spent my life fleeing, hiding. I mean, it's tough. Then it's time to end this. Once we defeat Eredin, you'll be free. Really? Eridin's hardly alone. There are others. They have plans for me. It was the sorceresses of the Lodge once. Now it's my father. Even Yennefer. You're forgetting Avalach. Avalach's different. He is intent on my gift not falling into the wrong hands. Not spinning out of control. It's why he teaches me. Protects me. If you say so. You doubt it? There'll come a day when Avalok will ask you for a favor. Most definitely that will happen. Perhaps. But if so, it will be a very, very long time from now. And I'm certain whatever it is, he'll give me a choice. I will have the option to refuse. Hope you're right. Like, she does own a lot, but if he tries to take advantage of that... That's Pablo. I plan to learn how to juggle one day. Incredibly useful skill. <laughs> Finally found you two. Enjoying yourselves. We are. Bonfires, wine, jugglers. What more could you ask for? I could name a few things I'd trade it for, but it's a <laughs> life. You seem concerned. He read right things through that. Things will go well with the merchant. <laughs> Lost cause. The man refused to trade. I said I'd buy. He asked three arms and a host of legs for one healthy animal. We need horses, but we'll have to find another way to get them. Ho, ho, I sense trouble. I knew you'd warm to the notion. We mean to sneak into the man's stable. With 30 head, a few more or less won't make a difference in his life. Oh, really? Coming with? Of course. <laughs> uh, what if we just buy him for you? Like, she's right into it. You know what? Forget it. She wants to do it. We're going to do it. Uh, what can I do? Got to help those in need. Yes, yes, yes. Look how happy she is. Must say, you didn't seem the type to me. What type? Steady. Time to go. We'll meet by the stables. Look at her. She's just stoked. Whatever keeps you happy. Let's rock. Hagar, keep a lookout. Siri and I'll try to get inside. All right. Looks like... Boss. Wait here. I'll go inside. Open the door for you. Hard to find good guards these days. Quiet. We'll wake them. I imagine we don't want to just go in here. Can I talk to him, maybe? Going up this way. We are definitely in. I just want to turn these all off. I don't think I can reach that one. Because that guy's sleeping. Everybody just be quiet.
Everybody quiet. been bad. Woohoo! We did it! Excellent work! Did you see the two fools who tried to chase us? Almost tripped over their own boots. <laughs> Thanks, Geralt. That was splendid. <laughs> oh my god. It's bad! It is bad! Uh, do we just let her have it? Like, let her have the moment? Yeah, a nice change from killing monsters. Thanks for your help. And for visiting. It was so good to see you all again. Hang in there and take care of yourselves. Don't forget us. So long. I must bid Valdo farewell. All right. See you at Dandelions then. Got some things to take care of in town. See you, Geralt. Yeah, I mean, I just kind of feel like with all the stuff that she's been through, like, could it really be that bad? It probably could be. Okay, where can I go from here? Because we need to go into Oxenfurt. Um, let's grab the port side gate, I guess. That was cool, just to like, run into people that she's been with in the past and... Kind of gives you a little insight on her. And she's just, she looks carefree people and she really envies them, obviously, right? All right. So I think what we're going to do, uh, this might be a little bit of a shorter episode, but I think it makes sense to start next time uh, picking up with Yennefer, who happens to be right there, so... I think that's the game plan, guys. Thank you so much for, uh, for watching, and thanks for the support. We'll see you guys very soon. Take care.